In this question, we have a wire in a magnetic field, and we have to decide about the direction and the magnitude of the force acting on the wire. To decide the direction of the force, we will use Fleming's left-hand rule, which I outlined below. So now, if you take a look at the drawing and point your middle finger in the direction of the current and your index finger in the direction of the field, so out of the page, you will observe that your thumb is pointing this way. Hence, this is the direction of the force acting on the wire. Next, we will use this equation from subtopic 5.4 to find the magnitude of the force. Here, F is the force, B is the magnetic field, I is the current, L is the length of the wire, and theta is the angle between the magnetic field direction and the direction of the current. Now, the drawing is a bit tricky because it seems like that the wire is at an angle. However, if you look at the direction of the current, which is in the plane of the paper, and the direction of the magnetic field, which is out of the page, you will notice that the angle between them is 90 degrees, hence theta in this equation is 90 degrees. So for the force, we get F is equal to B times I times L times sine 90 degrees. Since sine 90 degrees is 1, we get F is equal to B I L. Therefore, the answer to this question is A.